In early 1914, a spiritualist cinematographer from the Supernormal Picture Society of London joined the Royal Expedition to the Antarctic. In early 1914, a spiritualist cinematographer from the Supernormal Picture Society of London joined the Royal Expedition to the Antarctic. In early 1914, Globe fly convenient wall. The world made flat subtle all space. The spheres like air turned into into a rind that is fed into this processing machine, where the acid juice distilled from lost days is rendered from the surface of the strip and sent back into the void as an immaterially three-dimensional beam of light, splatting that peeled and squashed globe flat on any convenient wall. The world made In early 1914, a spiritualist cinematographer from the Supernormal Picture Society of London joined the Royal Expedition to the Antarctic. In early 1914, a spiritualist cinematographer from the Supernormal Picture Society of London joined the Royal Expedition to the Antarctic. In early 1914, a... So that I would understand, the bees showed me a little movie called The Garden of Eden Cave, starring me, Jacob Maker.
that spring on the farm. That was sprawling. That spring on the farm. In early 1914, a spiritualist cinematographer from the Supernormal Picture Society of London joined the Royal Expedition to the Antarctic. His name was James James Hivemaker hoped to photograph evidence of life after death. The next day, I arrived at Trinity Site, about 20 miles past White Sands. There were camera bunkers still standing from the famous test. Standing from the famous test. He wants to make sure he has one of these bunkers in his backyard there. For the kids to play in, for him to sit in once in a while, drink in hand, in whatever hand equivalent his new body has, thinking about all the sunlit days of his desert walk. Ruins of a camera bunker built by someone who wanted to echo the shapes of the local ridges. Designed by one of the New York architects attached to the Manhattan... The next day, I arrived at Trinity Site, about 20 miles past White Sands.